I'm a surgeon, so what does it mean if I get stressed? Let's talk about it. A recent multi-center study published in JAMA Surgery reviewed 793 operations performed by 38 surgeons from 14 surgical departments. These surgeons all wore monitors during their operations and had their heart rate and heart rate variability, a marker of stress, recorded. Prior research has shown that while operating, surgeons get a release of cortisol, meaning our fight or flight system gets activated. But this study took it a step further. They analyzed the levels of stress of the surgeons and the outcomes of their patients. Specifically, they compared the rate of major surgical complications, how long patients stayed in intensive care units, and mortality. Increased surgeon stress within the first five minutes of surgery was found to be associated with significantly reduced major surgical complications. ICU lengths of stay and mortality rates, however, stayed the same. This study reiterates that although stress has a negative connotation, not all stress is bad for you. Research has shown that some activation of our stress or fight or flight pathways actually improves our performance. This article not only perfectly illustrates how complex of a science stress really is, it also opens the door for more research to improve our performance as surgeons and get better outcomes for our patients. Make sure you check out this article for full details.